Well, in a preliminary hearing today, we learned more about a stabbing that killed a Toyota employee. His ex is the one charged with first degree manslaughter in Matthew Turner's death. LAX 18's Lee Searcy uncovered some of the troubled past between the two, and she has more about that from Scott County. Relatives say Matthew Turner traveled the world working for Toyota. He programmed robots. He was currently working at the Georgetown plant. But July 30th, his promising future ended here at the Mill Apartments. Police say his ex, Cassandra Carson, stabbed him in the neck during some sort of argument. That's her story. Details of that fateful night were revealed during this preliminary hearing. A Georgetown police detective testified Carson told him the two got into a fight and at some point she threw a kitchen knife across the room, hitting Turner in the neck. He was found just outside the apartment and died. By the downward angle of the wound, police believe Carson stabbed Turner up close and from behind. In my experience from that distance, it would be extremely hard to throw a knife from that far and cause that type of wound. Watch Carson's hands as the prosecutor asked the detective to reiterate information about the knife. He threw it that far and it went into the neck and that's what caused the wound. Carson wasn't supposed to be near Turner. He had a protective order against her from Indiana. A year ago in June, she was charged with domestic battery, then last December put on probation. But just this past May, records show she had violated her probation. Friends of Carson told me off camera Turner was the aggressor in the relationship, a claim his family denies. The case is now headed to a grand jury. In Scott County, Lee Searcy, LEX 18 News.